everyone welcome back to my channel today i am gonna be using the nomad royal Ur europe <laughs> and the Kara beauty upside down um pro 09 and this is you had me at aloha so here's that palette right here and i think it will do great with this palette very beautiful shifty shades um, so yeah, those are the palettes I will be using today. Kind of out of place because I didn't want to keep doing eyeshadow. I just want to show you my shadow palettes. Not eye looks always, but I haven't done this in a while. So let's see what look I created on camera. Usually I've been liking the looks I created. So it's not too bad. I'm going to go in with light into deep tones. So maybe like light tones over here. Thinking about starting with the pink one. Over here. That's called Sherbert. I haven't filmed because I've been so busy lately. So that's how it's been going. <laughs> I'm just going to do the inner portion of the crease with this shade. I kind of did like a pinky and then it went to really deep yesterday. <laughs> I've been looking and I think I'm going to use this shade right here. And this is called Dreamcatcher. It's like pastel shades are really pretty. But for me, I like a deeper, more pigment shades. So I barely go into like these pastel colors, but I think they're just really pretty. I really love the shades. I've been wearing a lot of these shades this year for like the spring and summertime. I really love the center ones. I'm going to go in with this one. Hall of Mirrors. Very pigmented. Like this packed a lot on the brush. So <laughs> we'll see how this goes gonna go in the outer portion with the shade just stamping it on first so I don't get shadow everywhere and I'm gonna go in with the shade right here this is palace of something I'm gonna go in with that one so if you have this palette let me know do you have any Cara Beauty palettes and what is your favorite nomad palette because I am looking for another Nomad palette because these palettes, like this is my first Nomad palette and I am really enjoying it. Is the other Nomad palettes like this formula? Let me know as well. I am thinking about that green like Paradise palette. I thought that was like, it's catching my eye every time I go on. It's like on my feed. It's like, get me, please, buy me. And I'm like, oh, I want it so badly. But it's like, I want a phone. I kind of want to get a new phone. Like, <laughs> almost a, I want to get a Samsung phone. Samsung Galaxy, the new one, the Ultra S. I want to get that one. It's like the biggest phone you can get. And I was like, oh, I want to switch up my phone. Like, that's what I want. I'm so used to the iPhones that I'm like, do I really want a Samsung or stay with an iPhone? But I'm like, oh, I definitely want to get a bigger phone. Like, almost a tablet size, right? Like, it is a big phone, but I don't know. We'll see what happens. But yeah, I'm trying to blend this in for my liking, and it's kind of 
kind of hard. <laughs> this one right here is catching my eye. It's really pretty. And the ballroom. This is like the third time I've used this palette. And boy, it is very pigmented, but very powdery at the same time. Very pretty, like, so pretty. I don't mind the fallout with this palette, but I don't dig into it much, so. I love the embossments in the shadow. That's really pretty. I was like, for my first Nomad, I want something new. So I picked this up and I thought it was really pretty. Kind of looks a little muddy to me. So I might go in with the lighter shade in the pink and see how that goes. So I want to get more use on this palette. That's why I'm mainly using this palette. Just to get more use on it. And I, I, I like the palette for the little bit of usage I had in this palette. And it, it does give my eyes a little bit darker. So I'm going to really light. I'm trying to lighten the inner portion out because it's really deep. The shadows are really deep in this palette. So I'm going to clean my brush and try to go with the lightest green. So this minty green, I think would look good. Good with this um, shadow, hopefully. Still not too dark. crystal clear is what the shadow is. Do you have any clarity? And what do you think? I'm only going to buy this palette at Marshalls because if you go on their website, they're like $30. I'm like, to me, it reminds me of Makeup Revolution. Not worth the $30, just about 10 And now that things are going up, I don't know how much they are now, but when I looked up, they were pretty pricey. So I'm going to go back in with the lightest pink shade. Just to go in. Just tap it on in the shadows. Clean the brush and go back in with crystal clear. Just go a little above the crease a little bit. Trying to fix up, and then I'm gonna put glitter primer. Where did it go? I don't know. <laughs> now I'm gonna go in with this shade. This multi chrome right here is just gorgeous. <laughs> I just love all different shades in this shadow. I think this would be a great color. Just look at those shifts. Gorgeous. So I think I'm going to pop that on just in the center. Everybody goes back to school tomorrow and I'm excited. My brother had to start work early, prepare for the kids. Yeah. I can't wake up in the mornings. I have trouble. I've been sleeping in until 8 and then going back to bed like around 10.30 and then waking up at 1. That's how it's been with me and <laughs> all I do is clean the house and cook. So I'm just, that's my time to wake up, I guess. <laughs> I'm gonna try to put the um, shadow above. And it's super hot here in Arizona, so waking up for me is a little hassle. And my preference of waking up. 
And then I'm gonna get into something lighter in the inner portion. Do I wanna, uh, kinda wanna put this on, just trying to brighten the look. Cause I still see it's like really deep. See, with, when I get this palette, it's like really deep and I don't want it just to have a deep look always when I wear this palette. So I'm gonna have to figure it out because it's super pigmented. I'm going Ride the Wave. It's the shade. This like minty shimmer shade. Just to brighten up the inner portion. Sorry if the angle is different. My boyfriend called me and see what I wanted to eat after work. I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> so I'm going to fix this green shade up with that multi-chrome. Oh. I'm sweating. I know at the um, AC at 80 because I'm like, no one's here. And if I sweat, it's fine. <laughs> I don't complain as much as other people in the house. So I'm like, I'm just home alone. So I don't mind. So that's what it look, is looking like. And now I have to go with the bottom eye. And I just feel like it's getting to a messy point here <laughs> that I'm gonna have to clean. Okay, first I'm gonna go in with a deep shade. So let's see. And then I'm gonna brighten it up along I, when I go. Um, let's see. I was gonna do, I might do this like mauve pink. I think that's pretty. Some shades look brand new and I'm like, that I dug into yet? I'm not sure. So I'm just gonna go in the outer portion with the shade. And then I want to brighten that up. Not with this palette, because all I see is just deep tones. <laughs> um, and I put pink down, so I'm gonna go in with this shade right here. That is called Just A Slice. That's just like vi vibrant pink, bright and Barbie. <laughs> Going in in the center. And then I'm going to go in with Aloha Spirit right here. That like corally pink shade. And just right next to the other shade. And then I might go in with yellow into the very inner corner. So I have choices of yellow, but I think I like this yellow for the inner portion, lemonade. So I want to kind of use this multi-chrome right here. Just go all over it underneath the eye. And then I'm going to use done with that palette completely and then I'm going to use good vibes only the shade the lightest shade in this palette and 
I'll do my finishing look and come back on. This is the final look. I really like the final look. <laughs> it scared me a little bit. It might be too dark. So my doctor called me and they said I had high cholesterol and low red cell, red blood cell count. So I'm even there. So I've got to make appointment for my primary doctor. And yeah. But this is the final look. I really like the end results. And yeah, thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment to my channel. Bye for now.